certified most accurate. Now your TV5 first alert forecast. Good Wednesday morning. I'm first alert meteorologist Matthew Mondro with your morning update. Now we do have a first alert weather day for this Wednesday. We're still focusing on those impacts on our roadways in the morning. Uh, we do have some snow covered overpasses and bridges and also some slick spots, especially on any back roads. So be sure to drive safely this morning. Leave yourself some extra time. And then this afternoon we're starting to focus on the potential for some heavier lake effect in the northern thumb too. That could be impactful for parts of that afternoon drive and those bus stops in the thumb. So we have extended this first alert weather day through this evening, but whether it's this morning or this afternoon, any of those isolated bursts of lake effect could lead to some rapidly changing roadway conditions. And as a result of that lake effect for the afternoon, the National Weather Service has also issued a winter weather advisory for Huron, Tuscola and Sandalac counties. Those all expire at midnight tonight, but again, it's that northwesterly wind during the afternoon that will bring that lake effect in off of Lake Huron and the Saginaw Bay. Now this morning on your first alert hour by hour, we are keeping an eye on that lake effect and that's coming right off of the Saginaw Bay that's still up towards the air that county area, but we are expecting that to pivot down towards the Tri Cities and also I 75 down towards northern Genesee County. You can see that on the hour by hour. So as that does move through, we are expecting some rapidly changing roadway conditions with that by this afternoon, the northwesterly wind taking over. So notice that lake effect really primarily focused on the northern thumb where we had those advisories during the afternoon today. Once we head later on into the evening, though, we'll start to see this tapering off overnight. A brief lull in that snowfall activity. We are first alerting you though to some more scattered snow showers on Thursday afternoon. This could line up with that afternoon drive and bus stop. So we are expecting at least a few travel impacts on your Thursday afternoon as well. Any additional snowfall out of that right around one to three or two to four inches across the northern thumb from that lake effect for today. If you're farther inland, not expecting too much more snow for today and right around another inch or two on your Thursday afternoon. But again, it's the timing of that lining up with those commutes that we want to uh, pay attention to on Thursday for your high temperatures today, right around 37, but closer to freezing farther up north and on your 70 forecast. We're still even colder towards the weekend. We do look drier as we start off next week, but over the weekend, still a few more lake effect snow showers and then highs in the 20s with lows in the middle teens. Stay with WNEM TV 5 on air, on the go and online for more news and weather updates.